So in this video, we're going to be constructing an angle bisector given an angle, angle A. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to uh, take the angle that we're given and we're going to cut it in half. And bisecting, we're always going to cut an angle in half. So here are the steps to bisecting an angle. The first step is to place the point of your compass on A. And then go ahead and draw an arc that intersects both sides of the angles. This is very similar to when we copied an angle. Um, so we're going to go ahead and stretch this. We want to make sure that as I rotate my pencil on my compass, that it's going to intersect both rays of the angle. So here I'm going to start down at the bottom, and I'm going to draw an arc that intersects both rays of the angle. The intersections of where that arc reaches the angle are going to be labeled as point B and point C. Now we're going to go ahead and place the point of the compass on point B down here. So we're going to move our compass and put it on point B. And we're going to draw an arc in the interior of the angle. Make sure that the arc that you draw is between the two sides or rays of the angle. So as I rotate my compass here, right now my pencil is outside the arc, so I'm going to shrink my compass so that when I draw my arc here and I rotate, it's going to be on the inside of the angle. It's going to be the inside of the angle. So maybe I'll make it a little bit smaller, and we're going to draw that arc right here and right there. So let's go ahead and draw that arc. Without changing the width of the compass, let's go ahead and place the point of my compass on point C, and we're going to make that exact same arc, making sure that each of the two smaller arcs that we have in the middle, we want to make sure that they cross twice. So here, without changing the span, I'm going to go ahead and rotate now, and I'm going to make sure that both arcs intersect each other twice. The intersection is going to be go ahead and be labeled G. So we're going to take the intersection here on the outside and label that point G. Now we're going to use our straight edge and draw a ray that goes through point A and through point G. Now because we intersected twice, there's a third point that we can kind of draw our line through. So as I take my straight edge, I can go ahead and kind of rotate this so that it goes through all three points right there. Okay. And just to make sure we're lined up there as best we can. Looks good. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my straight edge and draw a line going through those points. Okay. Once I draw that ray going through point A, going from point A through point G, we can now state, because we're bisecting an angle, we can say that this the ray AG bisects angle A, bisects angle A, or angle C A B. Okay, so that's our little short video on angle bisectors. Rewatch it if you need to see the steps written out again or watch the, the steps. Um, that's it.